got a bad feeling about this. Go ahead and roll for me real quick. Yeah, your your dad was cool. <laughs> I just run toward him. You're getting set ablaze. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, how did that get there? Oh no! He's point blank. Okay. <laughs> setting you on fire. What's your next action? He punches you in the elbow. I'm gonna give him a <laughs> gun. He drops out of the sky. He hits the ground hard. He's still <laughs> shooting fire in your face. <laughs> Damn, horns don't give him a tip. <laughs> Wants to make sure the best scar is good. It will be a cool battle scar. Grabs your neck. Ah. You're such a cheater. Well, so are you. Full. You just want to arm every robot. Yeah. yeah. You're still on fire. Destroying both of them. Ah. Ag surrender. You didn't really think it would be that easy, did you? This is a boss fight. Oh, God. Is everybody with us? Like the whole crew? Mm-hmm. So, you all have to battle the six Imperial Super Commandos led by Sergeant Vulcan. Oh, God. Okay. I'm going to do something. Okay. I'm going to bring out my rocket launcher. Mm-hmm. And I'm going to see what that uh, Black Warhead does. Okay. You load it up. Go ahead and roll for and me. Aim for their ship. Okay. It misses and hits our ship. <laughs> if you blow up the Crimson Minoc, I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> you fire the shell, and you see it go, and it splits apart, and a bunch of tiny bombs land all over the docking bay, and they detonate. So it's like a cluster bomb. Basically. Yeah. So it does minimal damage to both ships. Okay. They're a little. Scratched up and stuff, but overall the ex explosions did more damage to the docking bay itself. Did it at least kind of just knock them off balance? Like, no. catch them by surprise? No. <laughs> Can me and Cardo do like a combo attack? Well, yeah, tell me what it is. So, me and Cardo kind of like go back to back, and I use my flamethrower and my blaster, and he uses all six of his blasters, mm -hmm. and we just kind of spin around. Okay. Five. All right. Hmm. Alright, so... Mm -hmm. Okay. So... Sergeant Vulcan is heading towards you, and he's taking the shots, and the flamethrower's like nothing. Yeah. Pew, 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 pew! Some of the other... One of the Imperial Commandos eventually gets overwhelmed, and he falls over. Yeah, bitch. But the rest of them are still standing. So I'm guessing yeah. they're wearing, like, this full Beskar armor. Yeah. Okay. Mandalorians. I had to check. <laughs> One of them is on the ground. He's not dead, but he's on the ground. Axel is going to pull out his stun rifle, and he's going to aim it at Vulcan. He aims the stun rifle, and Vulcan steps in front of him, extends his hand out like this, and Axel fires him, hits him in the chest, and he, <laughs> and he stands there for a second. So, for whatever reason, he's not moving. So, is he that just, motherfucker's a robot. I was just about to say, is he a droid? So, next is Hazer, who you said wanted to die. <laughs> <laughs> and he's going to run up and try to get to the Mandalorian that fell over. He's going to pull the helmet off and shoot him in the face. He runs up, pulls the helmet off, and is about to fire, but then... Use the tether cable around his body, and the Mandalorian activates his jetpack. So Aww. they're going. Ether pulls out his Tonfa, and he's going to try and knock over Vulcan while he's not moving. He runs up, jumps, and hits him in the head. And Vulcan just falls on his body. So Vulcan is down. And now, it is Tanya's turn. She pulls out her own rocket launcher, and she's going to aim at the group of Mandalorians that are gathered together. So she puts a shell in, and she fires it, and all the Mandalorians activate their jetpacks and move away. But, a panel on the side opens up, and a tether shoots out, 
and stabs into one of the Mandalorian's necks. Nice. And eventually swings around, and it hits his head and blows up. God. How many Mandalorians are left? So that that's just one dead. Okay. So there are still four, no, three left. Okay. Next, it is Bantha's turn. He's going to pull out both of his rifles. He's just going to start spraying. Okay. Blast. All right. He shoots, and he hits one Mandalorian really good, and he just keeps shooting at the same spot over and over again. And some hits are bouncing off, but some of them are starting to leave dents in the armor. Next is our good friend, Yard Rat. Get him, Yard Rat. Yard Rat reminds me of Weasel from the Suicide Squad. That's <laughs> what he reminds me of. So, Yard Rat is running, and he pulls out a uh, thermal detonator, but like a, like a mine one. Hmm. He runs up, and one of the Mandalorians that are flying, he jumps up and slaps it on his jetpack. And Mandalorian turns around, and he's trying to feel what touched him. He reaches his hands back, and it detonates. Good one, Yard Rat. So that's two now. That was two more. Now, it's Rancor's turn. He's going to aim his grenade launcher at Vulcan while he's on the ground. He fires. And it hits him, but it doesn't get through the armor. Uh, it just kind of leaves a couple of burns on the armor. So now it's Dylan's turn again? No. It's the Mandalorian's uh, turn. Uh. <laughs> so, there's two left and Vulcan. So Vulcan stands up and he, his shoulder panel opens up and out comes a turret. Oh, Should God. The fucking predator? <laughs> and he's going to fire at Oligol. Oh, God. Everybody hit the deck. Roll for me. D6, everybody. Ah, uh, I rolled a one. Six. Oh, okay. wait. Can I, uh... You've had a rest. Okay, you uh, want to do the thing? So it's... Uh, I don't it know if I want to use this now or, like, while I'm attacking. It'll go straight to six, but your next roll will be halved. halved. Oh, God. I'll just, I'll just, I'll just, I'll take. just take the L. All right. So, this one is going to be for Axel. Axel, no! It does six damage. Oh. Axel gets shot. Uh. And it, and oh, no. falls over. No! You, because you take a shot, you get seven damage. Oh, God. Where's your paper? Uh, that leaves me with nine health. All right. Dylan, you evaded it completely. You're okay. fine. Next. One of the only times. Next is Hazer. He tries to run, and the shots go, and it tears through his leg. My leg! Separating it at the knee. Oh, God. Oh, we're getting fucked up. Hey, at least we got two of them. Yeah. Ether runs and tries to pick up Hazer, and as he's picking him up, he gets blasted right here in the shoulder area. But he manages to get him and get behind cover. Somebody get Axel! <laughs> <laughs> Tanya I'm on the floor. Tanya tries to shoot at the turret with her rocket launcher, but ends up getting hit first. It fires, and the turret hits the shell, and it blows her back. Oof. And she slams into the ship. Yard Rat, who was trying to sneak around and plant a charge on this turret, turret turns around, and it tears him apart. Oh, no. Dude, not Yard, Yard Rat. Rat. He's nothing but chunks. Oh, God. Next is Bantha. Bantha manages to pick up Axel and get out of the way perfectly safely. Thank, Thank you, Bantha. Rancor runs and tries to handle the turret and tear it out. But in the process is shot up. But he takes 
minimal damage, but eventually Vulcan just bats him out of the way before he can tear it out. Next, one of the Mandalorians is going to aim for Horns, who was just so gifted that he didn't get hurt, <laughs> and is going to activate the flamethrower. This is getting flamed up. Go ahead and roll for me, buddy. Um, three damage. Which, because of your new chest plate, does nothing. <laughs> you eat it up. Delicious. The other Mandalorian is going to aim for Bantha, who also went unhurt. And is going to, since they're behind cover, they're just going to use their jetpack missile and just shoot behind that cover. It goes... And it's going straight behind the cover. Bantha notices it. He picks up Axel and jumps out of the way, but the explosion still catches him. Uh. Bantha's fur is on fire, but he pats it out. <laughs> and he pats out Axel's cloak. They took only a small bit of damage. Now, it's back to you guys. So where, am I just out in the open? Yeah. Okay, there's no, like, boxes near me or anything? Not right now. Okay, um. Do you want to run to cover? I kind of, I want to find where cover is, mm -hmm. but while I'm doing it, I'm taking out my rifle, and okay. I'm kind of aiming for the turret. Okay. Let's we'll see how that goes. So, as you're trying to run behind cover and take aim, the turret notices your movement, it's motion activated, and it turns towards you, and it's going to start firing, and it hits you. Uh, for three damage, you're completely fine. Ting, 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 ting. <laughs> Chest plate ate it up. I'm going to do that long range attack. All right. What are you aiming for? I'm aiming for one of those Mandalorians. All right. Two. All right. Uh, Wait. Is this one going to miss? No, it hits. Okay. So I want you to roll, roll this one. Okay. Uh, zero. <laughs> okay, it bounces off his armor. <laughs> okay, can I do the, another one? Sure. Okay. Since it was that, will that really count towards that uh, we'll ability? We'll it does. Okay. Six. All right. He turns, and it punctures right through the lens. Nice. And he falls out of the sky. Right through the eyes, fucker. He hits the ground. His jetpack is still going, so it sends oh. him. <laughs> and he explodes yeah. against the wall. So, that just leaves Vulcan and one more Mandalorian. So, I think Cardo's next? Yeah. Because last time he did yeah. So, he's going to aim all of his guns at the turret to try and tear it apart. All right. He... And it... Nice. Turret blows up. So, Vulcan no longer has the shoulder-mounted turret. <clears throat> Axel is unconscious and cannot fight. Tanya is also out. Hazer, his leg is missing. My leg! Ether isn't doing too bad, so he is going to try and take out the other Mandalorian. He's gonna pull out his uh, hand gun and fire at their jetpack. He hits it dead on and he blows up. Nice. He's gone. So no more Mandalorians, just the... Uh, just Vulcan. Just Vulcan. Well, he's also a Mandalorian. Well, yeah. So, next is Bantha. Bantha is going to aim both of his rifles at Vulcan and just let that shit sing. Unfortunately, they all bounce off of his armor. Son of a bitch. 